Hi guys, this is a video tutorial from Adore Apps. Today I'm going to show you how to build a .ipa file for your iOS project. First of all, you need an IPA file to upload your apps to the app store or if you want to share your apps to the client or your friends for testing. To build an IPA app, I'm using here export 4.2. Let's start. I'm going to the Apple iOS developer account. Login with your Apple ID. Go to the Apple iOS provisional portal. First, go to the certificates. You need a distribution certificate. I'm creating my new certificate. To do this, open Keychain Access Certificate Assistant. Request a certificate from a certificate authority. Enter your email address and save to the disk I am saving it on my desktop done then click on the request certificate choose file and choose the file you just created click submit you have to refresh a couple of time to get the certificate download it now this is your certificate and open the kitchen access and drag it to the login now see that you have a distribution certificate so adore apps just created private key now again open the browser i already have added some devices and now i have to create an apple id app id for this for my latest app just description and do apps now this is important you have to create a unique bundle identifier for your apps i am creating my unique bundle identifier number is com.azureapps.test1 submit going to the distribution and create new profile here if you want to submit your apps to the app store you need to click app store if you want to share with your friends or give it to your client then click the ad hoc i am selecting the ad hoc profile name app i and select all the iphone devices so that i can test with all the devices now refresh load the provision in profile now open your xcode go to the organizer and drag your provisioning profile to the provisioning profile see this is the provisioning profile i just created app identifier com dot test for this reason i have already have a test project for this tutorial We we'll probably have some of yours configuration and set it to the distribution click targets info you have to match the bundle identifier to your provisioning profile now it's provisioning profile here is the for application identifier com dot to the apps just created click here and match same thing being for the project now it's almost done now select it's important select you have to select the ios device you have to select the ios device then click project archive now i just created test one 
have to create share already match my Adobe apps provision profile click next and I'm saving it on my desktop name it whatever you want now thank you guys if you like the tutorial please subscribe